car is handling perfectly, and once again, he begins to move away from the rest of the field. 79, Leffler is running second, Bill Lutz third. Chuck Amati has moved up to fourth. Joe Saldana is now fifth. Meanwhile, Perkle continues to move away. Second turn, Perkle hits a hole. He's airborne and corrects with instant reflexes. The skill of a dirt track driver is a thing of beauty. Steering with the throttle, running a turn in a four-wheel drift at nearly 100 miles an hour. We put it in slow motion and set it to music. And it became the poetry of man and machine. is the epitome of handling perfection. He runs through every turn like he's riding on a rail. Through turn two, Chuck Amati in car 44 goes around Greg Leffler on the high side to take over the second place spot. Big lead, Rick Burkle continues to put daylight between his car and Chuck Amati's as he grinds down to the checkered flag. Out of the fourth turn in a beautiful four-wheel drift high to the wall and across the finish line. Rick Burkle, winner of the first day main event. Number 44, Chuck Amati takes the second place spot. 79, Greg Leffler finished third. Joe Saldana in the 4A car grabs fourth. And Bill Utz in 56 lasts long enough to take fifth. With the first event out of a five-day meet under his belt, Rick's hoping for about four more reruns of today's race. But there's a lot of drivers and crewmen here willing to burn the midnight oil in an effort to give him a run for the money. One such man is Jan Opperman. He's here with a brand new car, and there's some bugs to iron out, but you can bet he'll do it. Right now, though, Rick Burkle is the man in victory lane, and his car is the one they'll have to catch.